Hello children and welcome to today's online class. Children, we have been learning chapter triangle. We have learned scalene triangle. We have learned about equilateral triangle. And we also have learned something about isosceles triangle. Let us do today some more questions from the section isosceles triangle. I have a question here children. Let us discuss about it. The question says the base of an isosceles triangle is 24 centimeter and its area is 192 centimeter find its perimeter so children isosceles triangle means a triangle having two of its sides equal let us take these two sides equal and this is the base of the triangle the base of the triangle isosceles triangle is given as 24 centimeter and we have to find perimeter children Perimeter means adding all three sides of a triangle is called perimeter. But we know only one side. We should know these two sides as well. Then only we can find perimeter. But, but point to be noted, both the sides are equal. So, as per my formula, the two equal sides are called B and the base is called A. That means value of A is 24, but value of B is unknown. So, let us start the solution of the question. So, my solution begins here. As you all know, area, the value of area is given. So, I can write area of an isosceles triangle area of an isosceles triangle is equal to 192 centimeter square children i have said to you all several times whenever area's value is given in the next step what you do write the formula of area of isosceles triangle here and equal to value and then whatever value to put you put it and what to find you find it now area of isosceles triangle we have learned as a by 4 root over 4b square minus a square where a is the value of unequal side base and where b is the value of two equal sides but b value is unknown here so we have to find the value of b from here equal to its value and you can see value of a is 24 so you can write 24 by 4 root over 4 b square minus a square means 24 square 24 square equal to 192 so 4 6 is 24 you can cancel and this 6 is in the multiplication form here can go and divide there so, you can write 4b square minus 24 square is 576. You can do it in the rough work. 24 into 24. The value will be 576. Don't forget we have root over here. And equal to this 6 will come and divide here. 192 by 6. You can cancel. 6 3 is 18. 6 2 is 12. 32 we got here. Next, children, we have to find the value of B. And until and unless you don't remove this root over from here, you can't find the value of B. So, to remove root over, we will do squaring both sides because a root over can be removed only by squaring both sides. So, you can write squaring both sides sides so what you can do 4b square minus 576 root over and squaring both side means put whole square and equal to 32 whole square now children just now i told you this intention of squaring both side was to remove root over so this square and root over will vanish only the internal number will remain and the internal number is 4b square minus 576 
equal to 32 square means multiply 32 two times. So, let us check the result 32 into 32, 2 to the 4, 2 3 the 6, okay, cross 3 to the 6, 3 3 the 9, add it 4, 6, 6, 12, 9 plus 1, 10. So, 1024. 1024. Next, as you all know, we are trying to find the value of B. So, keep 4B square here and write 1024 and take this minus 576 that side, it will become plus 576. Next, 4B square equal to children add these two numbers you will get 4 plus 6 0 7 plus 2 plus 1 3 that is 10 10 is 0 5 plus 1 6 and 1 that means 1600 next arrow b square equal to 1600 by 4 this 4 will come and divide can cancel we can write 400 here, what I can do children, I can write, here I have B square, if I write only B, then for removing square on the left side, we get root over on the right hand side. So, on the right hand side, we have 400 and we will get root over and therefore, B equal to root over 400 will be your 20, root over 400 is 20, no doubt about it, 20 centimeter, that means value of B is 20, that means this is 20, this is 20, this is 24, now perimeter is very easy, adding all three sides, so now therefore, perimeter of isosceles triangle, equal to b plus b means b value is 20 so i can write 20 plus 20 plus the third side is 24 and if you add all these three answer will be 64 centimeter children this is our answer children very interesting question as well as very easy so children you practice this question I hope you understood. Thank you children.